how do you identify yourself? Okay, so oh, so uh, you're uh, interested, so that you you have a team that. Okay, all right. Um, uh, which of you are working with Java? Okay, uh, my examples are Java, but uh, you have similar tools for other technologies, usually at least, um, and. The tools that I'm going to uh, show are, they're not really the point. The point is having a tool, not the specific tool. So I think uh, we're fine. Uh, just out of curiosity, what other technologies are, do you work with other than Java? Ruby. Ruby? Yeah. Ruby on okay. Ruby? Uh, Groovy? Okay. Okay. Um, okay. Yeah. Well, uh, in certain communities, uh, the apparently the 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 way of living is that you always build your own tools. Uh, I've understand that C and C plus plus generally go in that direction after some like fundamental tools like the compiler is in place and. Uh, some other communities like Java, they, uh, you know, perhaps the, the usual way of working is you take the latest, like, uh, popular build tool, but you never touch it. Like you, you just take what comes out of the box, but you don't really extend the tools much. Uh, yeah, I mean, the point is uh, the purpose, not, not the, the way you're getting there. Uh, I guess it's, uh, it's, uh, 30 past, so we, we should get started. Um, I'll first uh, uh, tell you a bit about myself, uh, mostly about my background. So I've, I've been um, earning a living doing uh, software stuff for uh, more than a decade. I've been uh, writing code for uh, longer than that. And uh, even though for the past maybe seven, seven years, eight years, I've been mostly uh, sort of working around methodology things, um, uh, training methods. I'm also a certified Scrum trainer, but don't count that against me. Um, I've been doing a lot of non-programming work recently, but I also do still I frequently work with teams, uh, usually not full 